Okay, today I'm going to be using vellum, I'm going to try and revive it. I know you've all got some in your craft boxes, probably about 7,000 years ago. Um, to turn it into this lovely little flower by transforming the look of your vellum. Vellum, as you know, is hard to stamp on, but is great for embossing. And here's a number that I put through my cuttle bog this week, um, using the scrolls and the dots and the paisley. But I will advise, if you are going to use this one that resembles tree bark, don't because it just cuts it into smithereens. So be careful which ones you choose. So I took this strip here, did this piece here, and I cut them into five one centimeter strips. Okay, they're roughly about three inches long. And what we're gonna do to make this flower, it's so quick and it's so easy. Um, you'll be thinking, oh, I am gonna to totally transform the way I do my embellishments in future. So, you need to cut out a punch using, I think this is about three quarters of an inch, maybe half an inch, probably half an inch. Uh, this is going to hide where you do your um, brads. My husband's phone's just gone off, by the way. Um, so you need to pinprick the circle first and insert a brad, any brad of your choice, as long as it fits centrally. And then you need to take your embossed strips, don't bend them in half, just fold them in half and make a pin prick with your pricking tool. If you haven't got uh, any foam like this, use the reverse of a, f of a mouse pad. They work brilliantly. And keep feeding your, what will eventually be petals, onto the brad. So I'm going to pin prick that. My hand's in the way there. I do apologise. I'm going to do that on the reverse. And you, you keep feeding it on until you put five petals on. Now, as you know, Flowers in nature look more appealing if they have an odd number of petals, so three, five, seven, nine. So keep feeding it on until you eventually end up with a flower like this. Really quick, really simple, and gets you using that vellum that I know that you've all got thousands of sheets of. Bye!